What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel and today we gotta do some more recruiting because this team is still not what we need them to be and later on baby after we're done recruiting after we're done checking out the top 25 we have got to take on number two Iowa that team is for real bruh so we are on top of some guys list which is a good thing obviously now these guys aren't really team needs but at the end of the day everything is a team need because we are trying to upgrade every single position man so we got a couple of dns we got a free safety who we are on top of so i'm liking that i'm really liking that this guy is 6'4 245 pounds runs a 4'6 as a defensive end this guy runs a 4'8 as a defensive tackle i don't know how accurate that is but I, i'm gonna take it all right i'm gonna take it anyways man as you check out the top 25 usc is number one then iowa is sitting at number two the team that we face today they just beat Iowa State, 52 to 23, bruh. Like, my goodness gracious. My goodness gracious, bruh. Miami's in the top 10. Texas also in the top 10. Texas saying them, they are number 10. Then Virginia Tech is number 11. After they lost 42 to 7 to Georgia Tech, they'll rank number 5. Not no more. Pittsburgh is a top 15 team. Georgia Tech falls back, or jumps up, I should say, to 16. Virginia is also a top 20 team, ranked at number 18. Oklahoma's number 19. SAU is number 20. Georgia's 21. Tulsa's 22. Purdue 23. Maryland 24. And UCLA is the number 25 team in the country. This is both teams' first game in the Big Ten. Hopefully we can make it a stinker for Iowa. Hopefully we can be on upset alert. Upset city. You know what I'm saying? The upset special, if you will. I'm hoping... But we're going to find out, man. Remember, this team won the national championship last year. That's right. The Hawkeyes won the national championship last year. But we ain't never scared, baby. We ain't never, never scared. Perkins, who was their backup tailback last year, is their starting kick returner and their starting tailback. And he's doing big things, bro. He's doing some big things, my man. Takes it all the way to the crib. But again, we ain't never scared. That, that does not shake us. We've been down 50 to nothing. Okay, maybe it, went with, it has never been that bad. But it seems like it has been at some times. Anyways, man. Willis, is he going to pitch that thing to Welsh? Welsh, he's going to run hard. Picks up a gain of about six. So second down and four. We give it to Golden. And Golden is going back. Hobbs is there for the takedown. Third and six. Looking downfield. Stop it. Pop it. Gonna find McNeil. And now we're cooking with Grease in Iowa Territory. Second down and 10. Willis, he's gonna keep it himself. He's a bad man. Please believe. Picks up a first down. So from the 24 yard line, looking downfield is Willis. Gets away from one man. He's not gonna get away from the rest. Williams is there for the takedown. Gonna get that thing to Welsh. He's gonna head it up that guy. And he picked up just a couple up that guy. So third down and long from the 28 yard line. Rolling now is Willis. Willis is going to keep it, and Willis gets past the line of scrimmage just barely. So we're going to set up for a 41-yard field goal attempt, and the kick is up. And the kick is good, ladies and gentlemen. So we're only down by four, but here comes Allen Young. QB keeper. Gets brought down by Porter. Now they're going to toss that thing to Perkins. Perkins, he's a bad boy. That he, he He's a bad boy, please believe. Takes it all the way to the crib. And just like that, it is 14-3. to three. They get some more pressure. That dude looking like freaking James Harrison. It might be the black and yellow in the fact that he wears 90, 92. Looking down there, though, we got Big Bo. Bo knows. My man Rick's coming through in the clutch. Second down and eight. Willis rolling out. Willis stop it. And Willis is popping. Give me that catch, baby. And we are inside the 20. First and 10 from the 19. Get this thing into the end zone, baby. Touchdown, McNeil. Willis out there throwing darts. Now what can our defense do? Can we get a stop? Oh, yes, we can. Give me that user interception. Give me that Yahoo Zay R, baby. And we got this thing going back the other way. Wait, so from the 46, John getting that thing to Welsh, and Welsh, he getting busy. Look at the moves. Weaving through traffic, gets us inside the 40. Second down to three from the 39. He's still matriculating this ball down the field as we get inside the 30. The kitchen heating up, and it's smelling good, baby. It is smelling good. All right, that play wasn't so good for us. Good play by Iowa. Third down and 11 for us now. Looking downfield. Stop it and let that thing fire. And that thing fires incomplete. So we have to set up for a field goal kick. Stop. And the kick is... No good. We missed it. 
it was a little bit wide to the right, you know, but hey, it happened. So we're still down by four. The hits with a play fake. Going to the flat, that's big fields rumbling and bumbling. The big tight end gets this one up to the 49-yard line. Second down and eight. Now they are in Eastern Illinois territory. Perkins is running hard. Gets brought down by Big Charlie, but not until he picks up a first down as we head to the second quarter of play. First and ten. Perkins with another carry. Perkins weaving through traffic again. Got too much speed, but Charlie is there for the take there. Can we stop this team from getting to the end zone? Perkins, meet Cox. Cox, meet Perkins. Good tackle. Second down and six. They run it again. Headed towards the end zone. He gets in there. Touchdown. Perkins, touchdown. Iowa. And now Iowa's up by 11. And then Welsh. You know, let me down, Welsh. You can't fumble my football, son. You can't do it. You can't do it. You just can't do it. So can they increase their lead? Going to fields on third down, and they connect the dots. Perfect pass by Young. First and 10. Play fake. Young rolling. Stop it. Popping in to find Harris, who is a fullback, but he is fast like a NASCAR. My goodness gracious. Second down and three. Young to the flat. Going to find Fields. Fields, he rumbling towards the end zone. Gets brought down by Dunlap. A couple of yards shy. So they run the end around. Diving for the end zone. You get stopped, Montgomery. You done got stopped. Second down and go. Up that guy goes Perkins. And Perkins gets met by a brick wall named Andy Jacobs. Third down and goal. That's touchdown. Iowa gets in there. 28 to 10 is now the score. We're down by 18. But can we come back? Bo. Ricks get to know Bo inside the 10 all the way to the crib touchdown Eastern Illinois that true freshman is the real deal holy field our special teams though not so much man our special teams right now is just it's just not and I know what you're thinking squib it they ain't got squib in this game and I know what you think let's kick it out of bounds maybe that could work but if we give Iowa a short field man I don't know if we're gonna be able to stop their offense already down 35 to 17 looking downfield that's gonna be caught by McNeil McNeil come to play man he's uh what one of our only upperclassmen on the offensive side of the ball besides Willis now we're gonna go with Willis on the ground the QB taking up a nice game but now it's third down and seven and on third down and seven, that's caught by Ricks, but well shy of the first down marker. So got to settle for another field goal. Kick us up, and the kick is... <laughs> we missed another one, man. Special teams all around is just struggling. 35 to 17 is the score as we head to the third quarter. Giving it to Andy Welsh. He's a freshman. He coughed it up, but we're going to trust him. We're going to show some confidence. We're not going to put him in a doghouse. No, we need our dogs to eat and protect the house. Golden, he gets the carry. Rumbles down the sideline, picks up a fresh set of 10. Looking downfield is Willis. Rolling out, setting his feet. Looking pretty as he tosses that thing downfield to McNeil. First down. Now it's second down and goal. Willis going to roll out. Look at the block we get from Nance. Oh! Perfect timing. Perfect timing. So we stopped them on the kickoff. We kicked the kind of short. They got the ball at the 40 to kick things off. Weaving through traffic is Perkins and picking up a first down is Perkins. Gets brought down by Porter. Going over the middle though, we get a stop. Maybe we got to kick the ball to bounds for the rest of the season. We got to do something on special teams because we just got to stop looking for ball ricks. Makes the catch. We're inside the 30. The kitchen is smelling good. Everybody is in there talking, sharing food, sharing candy, and sharing stories. Now I got a story to tell about Nance. And then I kick it deep. That's my bad, y'all. Okay? That's my bad. I shouldn't have. I, sh I shouldn't have. 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 Yeah. Anyways, man, that is going to be another touchdown, 42 to 31. Without those kick returns, let's say that we stop them because they didn't get those kick returns. Just maybe, just maybe, we win this game because I mean they would only have like 21 points because got 21 points on offense, 21 points on kick returns. That's going to be caught. Touchdown. We went three and out after they took that thing to the crib. And that was 49 to 31 because their offense did not go three and out. Did not turn the ball over and got that thing in the end zone. On third down, Willis coming through in the clutch, baby. Move those chains. Willis under some pressure. They only rushed three. We left the tail back in the block. We had six people blocking three guys. You would think the odds were in our favor, but you thought wrong. The odds are never in your favor. Willis looking downfield decides to keep it. Hobbs is giving chase, 
and chases Willis out of bounds, but he picks up a first down. Nonetheless, let's head to the fourth quarter of play. Again, time is not on our side. The scoreboard is not on our side either. It's third down and 19. And on third down and 19, we get sacked, man. We're trying to make something happen, but we just couldn't make nothing happen. Looking downfield is Young. Letting that thing spin on third down is Young to Hunter. Picks up the first down with ease from the 25 now. Looking downfield is Young. Has all day in the pocket as all of my D-linemen got pancaked. Every last one of my D-linemen just got pancaked. 56 to 31. Willis looking for Bo. The pass was thrown behind him. It gets tipped. And then Walker, Iowa Ranger. It's going to take that thing to the crib. Touchdown, Iowa. Iowa puts this game on ice. We played hard, though, man. You got to give us that. We were in the game. Quite quite possibly, if we don't kick the ball deep so many times, we win that game. Some people would say, without a doubt, you win that game, you don't kick it deep. Who knows what would have happened on those drives. We would have kicked it out of bounds or kicked the well short so that our main returner, Perkins, couldn't get the ball. Who knows? You can think what you want to think. I'm going to think that they were the better team, and the better team won. That's the way I'm going to look at it. But that leaves room for improvement, ladies and gentlemen. We can continue to recruit, continue to develop, and continue to make Eastern Illinois a power in the Big Ten and maybe a national power as well. My boys played well, though, man. I was very proud of these guys, especially in that first half. We were, we were fighting. We were blow for blow, toe for toe, baby. We really were. But then Iowa did what Iowa does. And that's going to do it, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope the rest of the day is the best of your day. And until we meet again, my friends, peace, love, hot sauce.